Checking finance now and the stock market closed higher. The All Ords up by nearly eight points. Our dollar is buying 71 US cents. Checking fuel prices, the average for unleaded petrol in Brisbane is $2.10. Diesel is the same. The average on the Gold Coast is $2.08. Busting criminals red-handed and shaming shoplifters. You're about to meet Queensland's tough-talking security guard known as the Kevinator. Logan father Kevin Martin takes on law-breaking citizens wherever, wherever he finds them, making no apologies for his strong-armed approach. Tonight we have the video to prove it. Hey, come mate. What's going on here? Oh, sorry, sorry, sorry. What's this sorry bull do it all the time here? Whenever, wherever, under the watchful eye of Kevin Martin, no shoplifter is safe. No, you've got to go back in and pay for this now. OK. OK, get your I... in there now. Walkie-talkie in hand and a camera capturing every criminal. Shut up. What else you got, dude? What else you got? Oh, there's another one. This is where you'll find the Kevinator lurking around shopping centres across the southeast, showing up the moment trouble strikes. Hey, you go, boys. Take it out. Take it out. In the aisles of supermarkets is where Kevin does his best work. Me, take me out. Take him out. A father of seven and trained security guard, he knows his approach is tough, but it is effective. It ain't going to be nice. I suppose you could say it's a little bit more old school security. Naming, shaming and documenting every sticky-fingered thief he spots. Your shays can't go shoplifting here, guys. The dumb ones come back. The smart shoplifters, they don't come back. From break-ins to vandals or teen bag snatchers like this. You see him in the shadow here, he's discussing what they're going to do. And then he moves in for the attack and grabs it. The old man's running for it. It's terrible. What, what's today come to? Yeah. You know, uh, two eight-year-old boys riding around that are going to rob people. It doesn't matter the crime. You know Kevin won't be far behind. A lot of people are quite shocked that they got caught and that I'm a little bit more forceful. While police may not be the biggest fan of Kev's confrontational work, businesses in Logan say he's making a real difference by helping to deter criminals, particularly youth offenders who are targeting stores here on a daily basis. 10 years old and they're vaping and smoking and, you know, destroying other people's properties as they walk past and whatnot. Rude language, behaviour, just dis destructive, um, stealing, just no care in the world. The Kevinator vowing to take the law into his own hands until the government steps up. And the Youth Justice Act needs to be abolished completely and redone. Annie Puller, Nine News. Well, it's time for the full weather forecast now. Gary, uh, I'm pretty sure you said it. You mentioned we might have some sunshine on the way. Absolutely, Melissa. I can't remember the last time we actually had a sunny weekend. Well, this weekend will be exactly that. We should see an improvement in weather conditions on Friday. A beautiful sunny weekend with temperatures back into the mid-20s on Saturday. That'll be the peak of the weekend, but a couple of wet days to deal with before we get there. Let's go to the radar firstly. And as I mentioned, on the south side, the heaviest falls, well, that was around Corumba with 17 millimetres. On the north side, it was Bribey through to Torbal, recording just over 20 millimetres there today and the rain gauges will continue to fill up overnight. On to temperatures now and once again they'll below average courtesy of those gusty southeasterlies up to about 60 kilometres per hour Redcliffe and the Goldie today while daytime temperatures struggling to reach into the 20s for Caboolture only 19 there today. Toowoomba 17, the high was 23 at the Sunshine Coast Airport here in the city 22. The weather map, rain and storms easing in WA, troughs in the east will weaken causing light showers inland with heavier falls about the coast. Capitals, windy in Perth with showers easing, cloud increasing in Adelaide, mostly sunny for Melbourne, showers and just 20 degrees in Sydney. Queensland, partly cloudy, Cairns and Townsville, a shower or two in Mackay, partly cloudy throughout the Capricornia, a shower or two across the Wide Bay and Burnett, sunny and 29 in Mount Isa, a little cloud for Longreach and Roma. In the southeast, cloudy with scattered showers along the coast and bayside suburbs extending inland with lighter falls. There is the chance of a coastal thunderstorm. Daytime temperatures between
between 19 and 22 degrees. Moreton Bay, the southeast is to 20 knots. Now the swell rising to two metres from the east from ex-tropical cyclone Gina, which is east of New Caledonia. So some dangerous conditions along the coast tomorrow. Brizzy, cloudy, scattered showers, a possible thunderstorm and a top of just 22 degrees. Your seven day outlook, cloudy with showers up to 10 millimetres for Wednesday and Thursday. Chance of a brief shower Friday, but a sunny weekend and 25 Saturday. Ipswich, a shower or two Wednesday and Thursday, partly cloudy Friday, sunny Saturday and 25. The Gold Coast wet Wednesday up to 15 millimetres, 25 Thursday. Chance of a brief shower Friday, but a sunny weekend. The Sunshine Coast wet for Wednesday and Thursday with up to 15 millimetres each day, but it will clear on Friday for blue skies over the weekend. Looking forward to seeing the sun again, guys. Good, good news. <laughs> Thanks, Gary. And before we go, here's a look at a story you won't want to miss tomorrow night. Tinder for home buyers. Find someone to buy a house with. The new risk-free service that finds your home buying perfect match. You can find it's going to be cheaper to buy than rent. Get a home for half the price in half the time. A better home in the suburb you want. Why Queenslanders are falling in love with this new housing scheme. Nine News tomorrow. And that is Nine News Queensland for this evening. Deb Knight is next with The Current Affair. Thanks for your company. From all of us, good night.